Hi, this is Sally. I am Mrs. Cruz's mom, and this is my buddy, Buddy, and he and I read at Read to the Dog. We read at uh, Grimville Library, and he's a really good listener, so he's going to listen while I read a story, and I hope you guys enjoy it. It's from my one of my favorite books and Mrs. Cruz's favorite books called Frog and Toad Together, and the song that we're, or the book that we're going to read is The List. So here we go. I'm going to show you the picture. Frog and Toad together. One morning, Toad sat in bed. I have many things to do, he said. I will write them all down in a list so that I can remember them. Toad wrote on a piece of paper a list of things to do today. Then he wrote, wake up. I've done that, said Toad. And he crossed out, wake up. Then Toad wrote other things on the paper. There, said Toad, now my day is all written down. He got out of bed and had something to eat. Then Toad crossed out, eat breakfast. Toad took his clothes out of the closet and put them on. Then he crossed out, get dressed. Toad put the list in his pocket. He opened the door and walked out into the morning. Soon Toad was at Frog's front door. He took the list from his pocket and crossed out, go to Frog's house. Toad knocked at the door. Hello, said Frog. Look at my list of things to do, said Toad. Oh, said Frog, that is very nice. Toad said, my list tells me that we will go for a walk. All right, said Frog, I'm ready. Frog and Toad went on a long walk. Then Toad took the list from his pocket again. He crossed out, take walk with Frog. Just then, there was a strong wind. It blew the list out of Toad's hand. The list blew high up into the air. Help, cried Toad, my list is blowing away. What will I do without my list? Hurry, said Frog, we will run and catch it. No, shouted Frog, I, can't, I cannot do that. Why not, asked Frog. Because, wailed Toad, running after my list is not one of the things that I wrote on my list of things to do. Frog ran after the list. He ran over hills and swamps, but the list blew on and on. At last, Frog came back to Toad. I am sorry, gasped Frog, but I could not catch your list. Blah, said Toad. I cannot remember any of the things that were on my list of things to do. I will just have to sit here and do nothing, said Toad. Toad sat and did nothing. Frog sat with him. After a long time, Frog said, Toad, it's getting dark. We should be going to sleep now. Go to sleep, shouted Toad. That was the last thing on my list. Toad wrote on the ground with a stick, go to sleep. Then he crossed out, go to sleep. There, said Toad, now my day is all crossed out. I'm glad, said Frog. Then Frog and Toad went right to sleep. So that was a story called A List, and it's in a Frog and Toad book. So I hope you enjoyed it. And Buddy did too. Thank you.